perfect afternoon. Uh, my name is Nelly Swam Lenzana from Cape Town. Um, I will start um, when I first came here with the seven frequencies uh, of the warfare and my first encounter. It was not a dream. I was here in the church and uh, when pastor started speaking in tongues and he said, God is gonna give us new tongues. God is giving us new tongues. And then I started, a, I, I saw myself ascending and where I was, it's like now there's this dark road, this dark road, but there's clouds. These clouds are dark in front of me. And then there is this dragon on my right side uh, in the clouds. There's this dark dragon and it's got fire in his mouth. And I started uh, praying in tongues. I started praying in tongues. I put on the whole armor of God and I started roaring over it. I started strangling it on the back, the neck. I put it at the back and then I just casted fire. Like he said to us, you must say, ah, then I started saying, ah, but it's fire coming out. Then it went back and I, 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 I defeated the dragon and then while I'm still walking on this dark road then now there's a serpent this serpent is not big but then now this serpent is come is coming to me like wanting to to put its venom on me but what I did I opened the mouth in between I opened the mouth and I casted fire inside of it as it is in two pieces it just fell down and then now a pastor just he is wearing a blue suit. He is not even looking at me. He just said to me, come, I'm not done with you. Come, I'm not done with you. And then the second encounter, it was when we were fasting. The third day of the fast, and then I'm praying now at home. At home, I always connect with the men of God. I always connect. Please, God, connect me with Pastor John Anusike as I am under his anointing. That is always my prayer. And uh, that day, as I was praying in the afternoon and then I think I started praying in tongues and then he just stood there. It's like now the, the clouds are white. These clouds, they are white and then he's standing there. He's pouring this one. This, this, this oil is in a glass. He poured all of it on top of my head and I just started shivering. And then he said to me, you will rule over nations. You will rule over nations. And then once again, he said to me, I'm not done with you. I'm not done with you. And when I come to church, I wrote my seven um, prayer points. In my prayer points, I said, I'm seeking to see Jesus. I've always wanted to see Jesus. But every time when the man of God just stands there, I've always said, I want the man of God to touch me. I want his hand. And today, today it happened. Before even he came closer to me, I just felt like now I am ascending again and I'm seeing this big lion roaring. It's gold. It's got white things in front of it. But the words that are coming out, I'm just roaring. Like the lion, the lion is, it is roaring. I am roaring as well. When I was in this dream now, it's like I'm in a dreamland, but um, I am seeing now heaven, I'm seeing light, I am seeing gold, and then I got up. The power of God is in this house. I would uh, suggest everyone, even if you are watching online, come to the house of God. The power that is in here, the man of God, has got power from God. I believe so, that the power that he has, as I've been praying, 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 
He's been, I've been seeing him in my dream, in my encounters. But today, I believe my story has changed. I believe even the seven prayers that I've put there, it has been answered. Because there's something inside of me when he touched me. It's like a release of everything. I thank God. Ooh.